Last summer I was really into macro photography and I used a macro lens together with my mirrorless camera to capture my macro photographs. If you want to check them out among my other photos, head over to my Instagram account. I'll leave a link for that down below. But there are other ways to capture macro photography than with a dedicated and expensive macro lens together with a expensive mirrorless camera. Right here, I got my hands on a macro lens for my mobile phone. This is the Apexel 200X microscope and it's really macro. I mean, it's actually 200 times zoom. So you get really, really close to the subject. My name is Roger and let's take a look at this thing. The Apexel 200X comes inside of this box. And in this box, you get the device itself, a USB-A to USB-C cable, a cleansing cloth and a leather lookalike pouch to keep all this in. Now, this device was sent for me for free for a review, but the company that sent it did not have any say in the content of this video. The device is made up of a lens. It's several lenses inside actually, that's surrounded by six small LED lights to light up your subject. You have two different brightness settings for the LED lights and to change between them, you just press the on off button. The USB cable is there to charge up the LED lights. Now I couldn't find any information on how many milliamp hours the battery inside of this thing is. It's probably not that big as it is a small device. What I did find is that by charging it for 90 minutes, you can use it for about 70 to 120 minutes before you need to charge up the LED lights again. Now, the way to use it is to place it on top of your phone lens. Depending on the positioning of the lens on your phone, you can adjust the Apexel 200X up and down to cover the lens. I'm using the iPhone 13 Pro. Most newer phones today have several lenses on the back, usually one regular, one wide and one telephoto lens. And to check what lens is the main lens, if you don't already know this, just hold your finger in front of the different lenses and you'll find the lens to use together with this Apexel 200X. Now that you have placed the Apexel 200X on your phone on top of the lens, just press and hold the power on button to turn on the LED lights. With this lens, you need to be really, really close to your subject to get focus. The best focusing distance is between 6.5 to 7 millimeters. And that's basically as close as you can get it. But with this on your phone, you get to see things in a totally different perspective than what you're used to. Now, here's a sampling of photos that I've taken with this Apexel 200X microscope together with my phone. So what do you think? Don't you get a totally different perspective than usual? I found this really interesting. To get to see things up close was really fun and totally different from the other macro photographies I've taken before. And I believe you can take really cool and interesting photos together with this Apexel 200X and your phone. Now, if you're interested in this little device, I'll leave a link in the description down below. 
and you can go check that out. That's it for this video. If you like it, feel free to give it a thumbs up down below. Hit the subscribe button while you're down there and yeah, maybe I'll see you in another video.